I'm a senior vice president at the MCE. Uh, I welcome you to our booth at Supercomputing 15. The MCE has been uh, involved in uh, high performance computing for a very long time. Quite long ago, EMC has been already represented in the financial uh, brokerage trading markets with uh, very high performance uh, storage. In uh, 2007, we started to participate at Supercomputing uh, for a number of reasons. One is that uh, we had a solution that was extremely popular in the life sciences um, and um, oil and gas and manufacturing verticals. And this is the Isilon uh, NAS um, uh, storage. For another, that we decided to, at the top of EMC level, we decided to uh, figure out what it takes to participate in the extreme uh, scale of supercomputing. Starting four years ago, we have decided to join very closely in the research and development for Exascale with the Department of Energy National Labs, in particular with the Los Alamos National Lab, with whom we signed a CREDA, still uh, in effect. CREDA is a uh, collaboration and research, um, advanced development uh, work. Uh, we did uh, develop a lot of technology together with Los Alamos for the exascale storage, which uh, has two major components. One is called PLFS, which is a Virtualized file system, another is a burst buffer, which is the first instantiation of uh, the idea that came out of Los Alamos. This was work that we put in open source, and it's at the roots of uh, a lot of industrial implementation of burst buffers, such as Cray's Data Warp or uh, DDN's uh, IEME. Now, in 2012, we uh, participated in the Fast Forward project funded by the Department of Energy, which we developed the next generation of burst buffer called IOD uh, for IO dispatcher together with Intel and uh, a company called HDF. So for us, the challenge was to take the technology that we developed for Exascale as a trickle-down uh, phenomenon, essentially, and apply the principles and the architectures that we developed into uh, products that are commercializable in the enterprise market. And this is one of the uh, topics that we are showing in this booth. It's called two tiers. And uh, two tiers stand for a simplification of the I.O. stack for computing, be it HPC or enterprise computing, so that Tremendous scale for big data can be achieved while good performance using Flash can be provided to the application. There are so much expansion of the big data volume that traditional storage systems cannot keep up. Fundamentally, we need to use object store to keep all the data. Uh, we're talking now about uh, a scale of hundreds of thousands of nodes of storage which is very different from the old technology, older technology arrays, local arrays. And uh, we're talking about separating that layer, the objects or the data layer, from the uh, layer that is close to the compute farm that does very uh, fast access in flash to the data. Two tiers is fundamentally the glue that allows data to move automatically between the flash fast tier and the disk object store, which is the capacity tier. It's the real-time analytics. People essentially have deal with continuously flowing streams of data. They have to analyze in flight and come uh, up with useful information. 
Uh, think of, uh, for example, the stream of tweets. I mean, people are generating a huge amount of tweets that are being analyzed uh, in real uh, time in order to figure out trends that are important uh, for commercialization of various products, uh, including ads. Thank you very much for stopping to our, uh, at our booth. Uh, I hope this is going to be enlightening for you and uh, we are enjoying uh, your presence here.